Mike Wolf has seen just about every type of old school Americana treasure, but he still has a soft spot for retro futuristic Schwinn bicycles. So balloon tire bikes are the coolest bikes because that was the era that everything changed. I mean, the industry was on fire. Chrome tanks, painted tanks, chrome fenders, uh, fender lights that were actually incorporated into the fender, different Springer front ends. Everything was extravagant. It was an extravagant time from the 30s up until like, you know, 59 when Schwinn made their last Phantom. They mm. made the Phantom from 49 to 59. They made it in red, black, and green, and it was their deluxe bike, and every kid wanted a Schwinn Phantom because when you saw that thing coming down the road, it was like a Coupe de Ville. It was a Cadillac. It was everything. So this was Schwinn's first real balloon tire deluxe bike. They made what they called the B10E before this, but it had what they called a toolbox tank. This has a door in the side of the tank, see here, that you can open up for the batteries, okay? And then if you notice in the tank itself, there's a light. And it's like, a, it's like a winged eyeball. This is glass and it says aero cycle in the lens. And then look how these truss bars here just barely clear the tank. Wow. I mean, that's, that's an airplane. Yes. That's a, that's a blimp. Yeah, you know, like yeah, and yeah, because, and look yeah. at it. There's a bomber on this. Right, right. It says streamline aero cycle. And then the tank is shaped like a bomb. Was there a political statement there? Or what, what, what they were saying was that this was so futuristic and it was directly connected, obviously, to the airplane that they wanted the child to feel like they were flying when they were riding it. This is the horn. Wow. You know, it's got what they call a gangway horn. So you've got a light here. All of a sudden, you have a horn. You have a deluxe saddle. You have a rear rack over the rear fender. And this was the start of it all. And red tires. Red tires. Yeah, they were playing with the durometer of the rubber. And you had blue tires. You had blue and white tires. You had red tires. These are the original tires. Really? Yeah. So this was very, very innovative. You know? That's just Isn't that crazy. incredible? Look you know, at that. This is what I dreamed about owning for so long. Yeah. You know, I mean, to find an aero cycle in a barn, you know?